biggest thing that I would say from a tip perspective <clears throat> is really for the singer is to actually be um, doing their own kind of compression when singing because a lot of times uh, you know I just like to do light compression on the way in but if a singer is you know if you're doing a song that has a lot of dynamics the singer can really really help you if they just back off or angle off a little bit when they go for those big high notes because otherwise you know you're not really gonna you know if you're if you're at a great level for the verse and it's kind of like a lower pitch um, and then the chorus comes they just start blaring you know you're probably gonna distort if you're going too low you're not really in the full sound of the mic or the mic pre if you're not at a proper level so I think it's more it's more for the singer uh, getting you know getting comfortable with where they are in relationship to the microphone I, I think it's also getting the singers mix, uh, mix right that that's a huge part of it um, you know if a singer likes to hear themselves with a little bit of reverb or a little bit of delay or none um, I think you know if, if you've got a good headphone mix going for the singer they're comfortable also the environment you know are they closed in um, you know all those things you know different singers have different styles the Sterling the Sterling ST69 sounds really good on male and female vocals I've tracked it on both um, my voice kinda has a raspy thing tone to it so that's the only thing you have to watch out for sometimes when you're kinda pushing a little more on the high end it's just if you got gravelly singer like me uh, you just have to <clears throat> it's always good to kinda solo it out for a second and see what you're getting you know, sometimes I have a trouble actually hearing between distortion and like gravel or dirt in, in a singer's voice because um, I tend to push the vocals a little hotter when I record them. But um, this, makes, this mic sounds great on backgrounds, really, really good on backgrounds too, especially if you're using, you know, a different style mic for a lead. That's why I like to do a lot is track different mics for backgrounds and different for leads. Just instantly gives it a different color. Mm -hmm.